Hey guys, welcome back. Today I'll be doing a Shadow the World Requiem Showcase. Let's get straight into it. So the first move is the click attack. The click attack summons three Requiem arrows which fly at the cursor's position. As you can see, I'm gonna click on I want to die. And three Requiem arrows follow them. So if I go over here, uh, they just go where my mouse is. So if I point, I don't know, over there, they go all the way over there. And they have a really long range as well. Alright, so the next ability is Quick Attacks. You do it by pressing the E button. You don't have to hold it like a regular barrage, which is good. So you can just press it and it goes. It does two punches and two kicks. The punches do 40 damage and the kicks do 80 damage. So the next ability is Uppercut. For Uppercut, you press the R key on the keyboard and then it does an Uppercut. It does pretty good damage, so I always like to use that in a time stop. Which brings us to the next ability, Time Stop. When you press the F key, it uses time stop, everything stops, then you can spam all of the things I have talked about, like so, and it does a ton of damage. So, the next ability is Arrow Rain. Once you press the T key on the keyboard, this happens. Tons of arrows come from the bottom dealing 100 damage each and 200 on crits so it's amazing and OP like he said. The next ability is Requiem Donut. So if you put your cursor over someone and press the G key on the keyboard you teleport to them and do 90 damage knocking them away. I like to use this not in time stop because well you can't use it in time stop. Um, it's really good to close the gap in a fight. So if I'm all the way on uh, no, over here and I do it, see that? How far it can go? The next ability is a counter called Scales of Horror. So when I pose, hit me. So when I pose, it looks like I'm drinking juice. They Oh, most stands when they hit me get hurt back alright so I'll ask him to hit me as you can see I teleport to well the closest person I guess to whoever hits me and I damage them back so do it again as you can see I teleported I don't know why I'm teleporting to them. I should be teleporting to them instead. But I am doing damage and that's what counts. So, on to the next ability. The next ability is Cosmic Orb. You press the J key on the keyboard and it summons a giant Cosmic Orb above your head to float towards anyone else and shoot lightning at them bypassing all of the dodges like sans dodges as you can see it's bypassing sans and it even killed sans right there it's about to kill this person as well but they're blocking and it stays for quite a while. The next ability is stand jump. You press the Z key on the keyboard and you do a stand jump. Just like that. The next ability is a dodge. You press the C key and it does this. It moves forward quite a bit. I like to do it in midair to give me more um, space or f to make me go further and the next ability 
is called Outside of Dio's World. So, ooh, free camera. Um, so, you aim your mouse somewhere and press the V key and you teleport there. It's, it's like using the Requiem Donut, but you don't have to aim it on someone and damage them. You just go where you want. But it has a limit. Like, I couldn't just go to the other side of the map if I wanted to. I can only go to, like, here. That I'd say that would be 50 blocks, 40 blocks. Or studs. And there's all the moves. Now, I'll tell you how to make this amazing stand. So to make Shadow the World Requiem, you first need to get the world from an arrow. It shouldn't be that hard to do, considering it's from an arrow, and arrows are really easy to find. Once you have the world, you need a vampire mask, and to use it with the world to create vampiric the world. Then from there, you need to get a camera, and use it on vampiric the world to get shadow Dio, or shadow the world. And then from there, you use a cursed orb on Shadow Dio or Shadow the World, and it creates this amazing stand. So that's how to get this stand. So, now I will show you my favorite combo. So the combo, first you time stop, then do arrow rain, and then do cosmic orb, I think it is. And then do uppercut and quick jab and then spam requiem arrows. This is the combo in action. Then just spam requiem arrows. It can kill multiple people at once. Plus, after the time stop ends, this cosmic orb will go flying to any of your opponents aimbotting them. That is why that combo is so amazing. If you enjoyed, please like, subscribe, and hit the notification bell to get notified when I make a new video. Thanks for watching, and see you all next time.